in Lower Rudolph. And our next rally is going to take place in France for the Tour de Course. So... I know this is our first asphalt rally in the 1600s. I just realized. Pretty sure it is, because we didn't do Monte Carlo. I don't think we did Germany either. So yeah, I think this is our first ra uh, tarmac rally with these cars. That's cool. So anyways, let's go. Yeah, so let's go to the two of the course. And, uh, yeah, away we go. Let's see how this car drives on tarmac. Because I actually don't know what to expect. Oh, oh. Are you okay? Hey guys, you like understeer? Because uh, I just got all of it. Every bit of understeer. Like, the car built it up over the, like, the rest of the first part of the stage. And just unleashed it all on that one corner. That was some shit. That was some shit. Stop it! Stop doing random fucking understeer. I like it. Let me angry. Other than the understeer, it's very grippy. Since we're on tarmac. It up. Oh, oh, yep, there's a bridge. Found the bridge. <laughs> it's fine. It's definitely not fine. <laughs> Don't die. That photographer standing right on the edge of glory. No, uh, is that a cliff? Fearless. Mm. Alright, there we go. Survive stage one. Yay. Well done, that was tougher than I was expecting. Yes. Alright, so. I got nothing. Stage one complete. Also, hi, boo. Slater, don't start that shit again. That was annoying last time. Marco Nino, second. Well, then. I have three of the Suzuki's in the points. Both of the Swifts, only one of the Ignatius C's. The C's. Alright, well, oh, got a little bit of an oil leak. Considering I just rammed into a tree at like 50 miles per hour, I'm, on, I'm surprised that's all the damage I had. So, let's go to stage two. And uh, continue our dominance. Yeah, considering I ate a tree, I know, right? It, it's fine. Yeah. Ready. This is uh Yeah. Again, yeah, we're gonna sweep every rally in this championship ball. I mean if I didn't I would be fucking I'd be screwed for the rest of the game. Because this is by far the easiest championship in the game. And I just broke the radiator. Ray. So I'm gonna build a car. Was it the Nike one? 
six right tightens. Into four right, 100. Caution, three left. Six right. Over crest, into four left tightens. Keep right, over crest. Mm. Six left long. Oh, shit, damn it. Hey guys, you know those unrecoverable slides? That was one of them. Car's just like, yeah, I'm gonna go this way. And there's nothing, literally nothing you can do about it. I barely made that. Sony Vision S. Sounds like it's something that's going in GT Sport. Oh shit. Two right, long open. That was wet. I don't even Six know what the hell is happening there, but that was, uh, okay. What a time to have a water main break. That's definitely a double caution. I understand the double caution now. Holy shit. That was scary. Right, let's see if I can take a look at this. Okay, I guess it's gonna make me... Eh, it's nice. Looks like your standard car. Nothing really else to say about it. Anyways, stage two down, Phil takes second, so there's that, Luco in six, so I'm pretty sure he's just giving up. And yeah, so, oh, we got both Suzuki, we, we got two Suzukis on the podium now. I think it's both uh, models, we have the Swift and the Ignis. Oh shit. Oh, Phil had a bad stage one, I didn't even realize that. And Luco's one spot above him in, like, half a second, but it's too little too late now, Luco. I punctured and I cracked the radiator. That's a shame. And now it's fixed. So let's head on to the final stage here in France. Code de Crazy. And uh, in the penultimate round of the 1600, I forgot how quickly these go by in this game because it's only three stages. I mean, we're covering like what, 10 miles at most through the entire rally. I actually don't know what the conversion is on like 13 kilometers. Miles, but still. Three left long. I'm sure, some of these rallies are less than ten miles. Go! I almost just killed a bunch of people. Well, that went well, except it didn't. Carmack specialist, by the way. Me. Into five right. Six left. Three right. Forty. Three left long. Keep it up. Oh, that was the smoothest breaking I've done yet in this game. Two Jesus. Right now, if I could just do that every time from now on, that'd be Over awesome. You know what's not gonna happen? That. And four right. Two hundred. <laughs> Right, four left short, and five left short, forty, four right, over bridge, 
Caution, two right, one hundred. Oh god, bridge. Wet bridge. Two left long. Wet and narrow. Very narrow, actually. Right and three left I'm honestly surprised it didn't hit the bridge because how right. narrow that was. Five right. Into four left. Four right short. How like four not right. good at this game I am. Three right, very long. Oh, Easy. Yeah, I heard that fucking Hatsune Miku is going to be at Coachella. Or Hatsune Minutes, excuse me. Good work. Yay, 32 second stage win. Hopefully I won the rally by a minute. Hi, Paul. Dominated. But that's just kind of this championship in a nutshell. Dominated. Who's surprised? Because I'm not. Fucking super bad mode. So there... This is the results of the final stage. Ooh. Four, two, three in the final stage. It looks like we're not gonna get our double Suzuki podium. Oh, hey, my teammate finished last in this stage. Good. Not good, actually. Yep, both of the Suzukis dropped off the podium. They almost dropped out of the points. Actually, one of them did drop out of the points, I think. Yeah, it was David Jones. He went from, like, third to ninth. Whoops. Phil ends up second, beating Luco. By like four tenths. Closer to your eye again. Bad day. Uh, yeah, you'll have those. I have those more often than not. Another ween. So now we get. Well, actually, we're going to get two scenes here because we're going to get the regular podium ceremony here and we're also going to get the championship celebration. Because I've now mathematically clinched the title. Hatsune Mike. Well then. Anyways, there's the points. 70 to 52. And Phil also has an 18 point advantage to, on Luco now. Pretty much all the top five spots are settled. And there's that. Here's the updated manufacturer standings. Lost another three points to Ford. But, still have a 12-point advantage, so that's more than enough to uh, take the Manufacturer's Cup. So long as I win the last round, which I absolutely will. But anyways, congratulations! You won the Super 1600 Championship Trophy! And an extra 1,000 unlock points. Yay! I did it. That was my New Year's. Uh, it was just a day. A normal day, except I was more sad. Woo. Champion. No champagne yet, though. Alright, let's move on to the next round.